So it is time for our pet of the week segment and I am just so in love with this little cutie. We're joined by our buddy James from the Connecticut Humane Society. Now this is little Mufasa. Yeah. What an interesting name. Now before I get into this, hold on guys. So um, little Mufasa has just been such a good boy, but if I can turn him around and you guys can check out his little <laughs> outfit. Can we get a close up? Look at that. Sandra, one of our staff members <laughs> felt like a really good prop today good for Fox 61 would be this, this you know, name Mufasa goes really good in this little tiny package here. <laughs> but, so uh, tell us a little bit about how you guys got Mufasa, James. So Mufasa's mom came into Connecticut Humane Society pregnant. Uh, mm -hmm. One of our wonderful foster uh, volunteers, fostered mom, and then ultimately the litter. Yeah. All of Mufasa's litter mates have been adopted. He is our last one. And um, again, our volunteers are really kind of the lifeblood of our organization, but fostering right is a wonderful way to be able to give back to the animals that deserve uh, attention in, in a normal home setting. All right. Now, um, a little chihuahua mix. Okay. And so, um, again, he's going to grow into a big name, but a little tiny package, maybe 10 pounds, okay. 15 pounds. And uh, the littler dogs tend to live longer. But he is just such a sweet, sweet, he loving is. puppy. He is. He's been so calm. Not a not anything out of him. Not a yipe. He's just taking in all the settings. Look, I can it's guarantee your time you to he shine. will whine and he yeah. will do things that little puppies do. Little puppies do, do that. Yeah. He did it on the car ride here, but right Aww. now he's pretty chill. Yeah, he's inside. He's checking everything out. I wonder what he's mixed with. What, what's my You know, probably some kind like? of terrier. That's kind of our go to. You okay. know, there's so many terrier really? varieties out there, but oh. he's chewing on your dress <laughs> now. <laughs> so. But uh, we would love to find a home for him, you know, yeah. before the end of the year. Hopefully he goes home today. Yes, hopefully. I mean, come on, guys. Look, look at this little cutie. It's your time to shine, Mufasa. Show off that pretty little yeah. face. Yeah. There we go. Take him home. He's such a sweetie. Now, what's his temperament like? You know, a typical puppy, you know, burst of energy and then snoozing and yeah. then more energy and <laughs> snoozing, eating, pooping, eating, pooping. Um, <laughs> But, you know, at this age, this is the best time to get them to train them for housebreaking and, and to chew on appropriate yes. things. Yes, um, appropriate things. And our, our staff and volunteers will be more than happy to work with the adoptive family. Uh -huh. And then part of the package of our adoption uh, with puppies is you do get a, a training afterwards where you'll come in for kind of puppy kindergarten. Learn, nice. learn those tricks so that you can have a wonderful member of the family. Yeah, awesome. Well, I love that. And hopefully little Mufasa gets adopted here. This cutie, I want to take him. I want to foster now says, him. I'm going to take off my Oh, uh, yeah, vest. now he, he's I'm sure about his own <laughs> shirt. <laughs> well, if you guys want little Mufasa here, the little dog with a big roar at some point. Yeah, I'm talking about you. <laughs> you guys know where to go. Head over to the Connecticut Humane Society and check out this little baby and the other ones that need a home. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. Thank James. you, and we'll see you next year with another. Oh yeah, pet next looking for year. A home. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Let's check back.